All right, welcome back to the channel. You know, just when you think spring has arrived and the cold weather's behind you, you get another cold front. So, for today's video, we got out the day after a major rain event. And it was, you know, it was a cold front, so the wind was going to be blowing. Uh, but you got to go when you can go. And if you've been, you know, following along, you've seen me throw the Texas rig lizard and have pretty good success. This time of year, uh, any lake that's got bass, pre-spawn, um, the lizard, they just instinctively want to kill it because they're protecting their area. You know, they've the bass have started to move up. They're, they're picking out areas that they want to bed in. And it's just an instinct for them to protect that area once they've kind of determined where they want to set up shop. So now's a good time to take a kid fishing or someone who's new to fishing that, you know, it's a good way to, to learn how to fish. Um, but man, we caught a ton of fish today. Um, had to wade through quite a few smaller fish. There's a lot of buck bass, little males that have moved up. But if, if you stick with it, um, you can end up catching some good ones. So, so, you know, watch this one all the way through. There's a couple of good kickers towards the end. Uh, the old lizard really comes through, but thanks again for watching. Stay tuned. All right, thanks for tuning back in. We're, uh, winter has not given up. We're out here uh, after a big cold front and it's cold this morning. It's going to have the fishing slow, I'm pretty sure. But we're still going to be able to catch them. <laughs> right off the bat. Yeah, I'm saying that he uh, pumped it pretty good. Been paying attention. If you've been paying attention, the old lizard has been working, and that's what we're throwing. Who is it cold? So we're within sight of the boat ramp. Haven't even had to start the big engine. Man, the wind is gonna be blowing. It's it's already blowing pretty good. Not a big boy, but I don't yeah, that's a lot of buck bass, yep. Nice chunk. No, he was out a little ways. So I just had to re-rig since that fish took it a little deep. But one thing I always do is pinch the barbs down on my hooks. That way, if you do get one, you know, when you unhook them, you're not hurting them as much. So I just pinch the barbs down. Okay, brand new lizard. I'm ready to go. You haven't caught one over there yet? Man, just when you think spring is here, there's always another cold front. So when you, when you, especially using this lizard, sometimes they'll swallow it. And if that's the case, just cut your line. Give them the hook. It'll rust out. The fish will be fine. You don't have to hurt the fish. Uh, gotcha. oh, 
Took it a little deep, but that's, you know, I'll take it. A lot of, I think it's a lot of male bass. And since I pinched my barb down, I got that out of him, no problem, unharmed. <laughs> that's three. Boy, they just, they love the lizard, I'm telling you. Got, got him. Yeah, that's another, not very big one. But. It is a largemouth. Oh! I had one too. Had one on too. A little largey. He was coming right at me. I think he was little though. Yeah, you know. They don't all have to be big. Okay, that's it. It's time for the gloves to come off. I, my hands are just gonna have to be cold. I'm trying to salvage what's left of this lizard. Boy, he's not looking too good. Ain't no luck, he's on. Look. He came back and got it. Ooh, ooh, it's a good one, Dana. Yeah. Well, better one. Yeah, not bad. It's a nice, nice spot. Yeah. Bigger. <laughs> I'm telling you, that lizard, they just can't say no to it. It's. Cold front, and it, that wind is cold. But we've caught plenty of fish. Like I say, I think they hit this lizard more out of instinct. You know that some of them will hit it because they want to eat it. Some, of, I think, a lot of them hit it just to protect their territory. to the tree. Yeah. yeah, they're long and skinny, you know, they're not not giants. <laughs> the old lizard, it works. They're getting a little bigger. I mean, they're still fun. I don't, you know, it don't bother me. Yeah. Oh boy, man. It's a monster. 
It's a monster. Largy. Well, there's a kicker. <laughs> yeah, I had to give him my lizard, but that's all right. Whoa, and he hit it in the middle of nothing. Yes, I, I, I didn't even feel him hit it. Well, that had to be on the five. Yeah, that was a big one. I think that was probably a five. So we're fishing the back half of the creeks. If you can find water that's clear enough to fish. And you'll have to wade through some of the smaller fish to get to the big ones, but that was a good one there. And if, if you haven't been following along, it's just a Texas rig lizard. I'm still throwing an eighth ounce weight, glass bead, a three-aught round bend worm hook, We're really fishing in tough post-frontal conditions, <laughs> but the power of the mighty lizard comes through. I'm telling you, it's it's deadly. Well, how many have we caught? We've Six. caught. We're getting close to 20, I think. Well, how many have you caught? You came close to 10. Yeah. Nice one. Another, another little male. Boy, you gotta wade through some of the smaller ones. They're feisty. To get... You know what? It's we've caught a lot of fish today. It's a little guy, but they don't all have to be big. It's still fun. Nice, nice big spot. The wind is blowing almost too hard to fish, but I felt him whack it. Right on the bank, wasn't it? No, he was out a little ways. Just, just gale force winds making it pretty tough to fish the old lizard. Again, I only got an eight. Nice largey. That's two on two casts. If you go to a heavier weight, you just don't get as many bites. I, I... Boy, that spot was a good one, Zane. Yeah, that was a good handy. That was a nice one. I wonder if I need to put my gym bug on. I, I Zane, I'd, I think you should try it, especially in this, this water's pretty dirty. All right, thanks again for tuning in. 
make sure you give it a thumbs up um, stick around uh, stay tuned for upcoming episodes I've got some good stuff coming up uh, man it's a great time of the year to be out fishing it's a little crowded right now but don't overlook the lizard I'm telling you they uh, they they won't pass it by yeah we, I've really caught it over the last you know well over all over the years this time of year I've caught a ton of fish on a lizard <clears throat> but thanks again make sure you're subscribed and I'll see you next time <laughs>